Yo, what is up guys? Um, today I'm gonna be teaching you how to get MBT Editor for free. If you don't know what MBT Editor is, pretty much what it does is it's a, uh, a program to be able to, like, um, well, you know, edit Minecraft Xbox save files. Now, um, what I mean by that is you can, like, add in villagers, train villagers trades, um, and stuff like that. Um, now with this, you also need to get Horizon. Um, I'm not gonna show you how to get that in this video. Uh, you can just look it up on Google. But if I were you, I would look up a YouTube video just because on Google there's lots of other web, uh, other companies that are trying to fake Horizon because there's lots of people that use it. So if they're trying to like put viruses into it, so I'll be careful because I'll look up a video on how to do it. It would be safer to do it that way. Now, um, today I'm going to be teaching you how to get MBT Editor, MBT editor as I said. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to download the two files. Now, yep. Um, so I'll put these in the description below. So first, what you're gonna want to download is you're probably gonna want to download this one first. It's very small. Uh, this is pretty much the crack. What a crack is is it's uh it's overwrites the original file to change it and uh, cha it changes small codings to make it that it will like you know work without uh, money. So what you're, now what you're gonna want to uh, download is you're gonna want to download the um, MC360 MBT editor setup, which is gonna be in the description. So what you're gonna want to do is after you download that, you'll get this folder right here. Uh, you're just going to open it up, pretty simple, uh, just click next, if you want you can also download it from the website I'm pretty sure, but if I were you I'd do it like this just because I don't know exactly if they mess it up or not, so you click agree to terms, next, um, do that, next, but of course, it, it, for you it's going to say um, this location doesn't exist, would you like it to be created, um, but I already installed it, so yeah, I'm not going to install it again though, but you know, if you want, you don't have to trust me, I'm not trying to get you to trust me I'm just trying to help you because trust me I really wanted this program and I couldn't afford, uh, afford it uh, later not later but uh, before uh, now I can of course but before I couldn't I decided you know I'm gonna help other people out because I really like modding and um, okay yeah, I'm just gonna close clo close that so once you uh, download it you should get this program make sure by the way once it's done downloading it will say uh, do you want to launch it Click no because I'm, I'm pretty sure it would affect it. But anyways, I'm gonna open it up just to see you show you that it's not activated. It's the activated MBT editor now. Blah blah blah. Now what you want to do is you want to right click the uh, the shortcut shortcut right click it. Click open the to file location. Now what you're gonna want to do is you just want to um oh yeah also by the way once you download this thing you want to you know, right click extract. And you're also gonna need WinRAR by the way. I'll I'll leave a link to that down below. Um now. What you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to drag this into the folder. If you um, you know hover over it, you should see a little thing that says "Move to uh, MC360 MBT Editor." Just drag that in there. It's gonna ask if you wanna replace it. Just re click say replace it. Click continue if it says that, and it should do it. There we go. Now what you're gonna want to do is you wanna open it up, and yep, it worked. And it's gonna say cracked. So yeah, uh, this is the older version, so it may be a bit glitchy. I um, I might make an updated version with uh, the 1.9 I think it is but uh, yeah guys if you enjoyed this video if this helped you make sure to leave a like and uh, um, also I'll see you all next time and if um, you want more tutorials on how to get uh, programs for free such as Photoshop uh, you know super hot games like that stuff like that of course I bought this one but um, before on my old computer I you know got it for free um, but trust me, everyone gets things for free nowadays, but I make sure to, when I get things for free, what I do is I get it for free, try it a little bit, if I like it, then I'll buy it, if I don't, I just won't, you know what I mean, because um, I don't want to pay some pay for something and waste my money if it's not good or if it doesn't work with it once I uh, first got it, and that was like with everyone, it wasn't working, and I'm glad I actually tried it out first and didn't buy it immediately, because otherwise I would have wasted my money, now it's fixed of course, but uh, yeah guys, if this video helped you out, make sure to leave a like, and I'll see you all next time, peace.